game. Today, we are going to be playing some more Chrono Trigger. Uh, last time, we made a, quite a lot of progress. We traveled back to the past. We defeated some evil priest, I think, if I remember correctly. And now we're in this weird mechanized world. It looks kind of like it's a post-apocalyptic future. I'm not entirely sure where we are, but I know that we have a boss fight coming up. And we'll jump off from there, so that ought to be interesting. But yeah, I'm really excited to play some more Chrono Trigger. Um, or I still don't know how it, you're supposed to pronounce it. Is it Chrono Trigger? Is it Chrono Trigger? I have no idea. But regardless, um, we are going to continue. Uh, just give me a second to set the final few things up. And then we will start. Hey, Shivis, I'm doing okay. I'm just trying to finish the last few things up for setting up, and then we will start. I'm I will say I'm really looking forward to continuing this game. I had a really fun time the last time, even if I got my butt handed to me during that one tank boss. That wasn't great, but what are you going to do? <laughs> There are definitely times where you will have your butt handed to you in RPGs and you just gotta either grind or try a different strategy. That's just the way it goes, sadly. Well, not not really sadly, I like that. I like that these are that these kinds of RPGs really force you to either like to try out different strategies and see what works. I mean, the grinding is not great is often annoying, but I don't think this game, from what I heard, this game doesn't require too much grinding, at least until the very end. So, let's, uh, let's see where we go from here. I'm, I'm, I'm curious, I'll put it that way. Uh, just give me an extra second to fix this up, and then we will be good to go. Alright, I think I'm just about ready, actually. Yep, alright, let's start. I know I'm a little bit early, but this will be a good time to catch up on where we left off. So, let's boot up the game. Thankfully, it launched. I was a little worried that it wouldn't launch again. Hopefully, you guys can see it. Just move it over here. There we go. And here's the title screen. All right. All right. I'm a little nervous about this, but uh, resume bookmark game. Sure, I guess. Uh, I, apparently, I want to be at about level 10, so I might actually do a little bit of grinding. Um, just because apparently you want to be at about level 10 while you're doing this. So, alright. Apparently the ladder's down there. Let me make sure I'm... Yes, I want to rest in the Enertron. HP and MP restored. Nice. But I'm still not as hungry as before. Let me actually quit out of something real quick. There we go. That'll make things run a little bit smoother. And sure, let's head down the ladder. What's this? This console controls the door lock. We need a password to get through. Oh, I have no idea what the password is. Alright, uh... Well, let's see what we can do here. No, no going that way. Nope, can't go that way. Or that way. Alright, what about over here? Let's see, it looks like there's a pretty... simple route through this. What the hell are you? It appears to be a decorative statue. A note is attached to it. Warning, anyone approaching the food stocks is subject to attack. Well, that's definitely warning us of a boss fight. That's for sure. Let's see if we can take it on. If not, we'll do a little bit more grinding to get up to like level 10 or something like that. I bet you this is the food stocks. There we go. For boss time! Initiating command sequence. Chrono, what's that? Marl, let's smash this thing. Here we go. All right, uh, let's see what we can do. 78 damage. I'm wondering if it's better to take out the uh, two sentries first. That's a lot of damage. All right, let's do a combo. Actually, no, let's 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 attack that. And here we'll do a fire whirl on this guy. Oh geez, this is already not going great. All right, well, I definitely need to use a healing item. All 
Alright, let's use an item. Let's use a... Uh, let's see, let's use a potion on her. And let's use a lore on... No, I want to use um, aura on Chrono. And let's do Fire Whirl on the main boss, and I will use Allure again on myself. Oh, let's use... No, I want to use um, Aura on her. This is going terribly. I'm afraid... Oh, jeez. Please don't die. Well, damn it. I am so dead. All right, this boss is destroying me. Uh, item, potion... Item, potion... Oh, I'm dead. Okay, yeah, there's no way I'm surviving this. I definitely need to be a little bit of a higher level before taking this one on. Nope. Uh, no, potion... I definitely need to be higher level before taking this on, because I am just getting destroyed! Alright, I'm gonna definitely... Let's see if I can do this a little bit better. How much how much damage do these guys Okay, so that one's dead, thankfully. Alright. Use tech on. Okay, I see. So yeah, you definitely need to take out the sentries first. I understand that. That being said, I am totally dead. Okay, I'm dead. Whoops. Alright, uh, let's grind, because there's no way I am doing this otherwise. Oh, I start back here? Uh, I don't want to start back here. I want to go out to the, uh, out to the outset and try and grind a little bit. Because there's no way I'm at the high enough level for this. I, I saw that the required level was, like, level 10. And I am not a high enough, uh, at a high enough level for that. I also want to buy some more equipment. Because I got destroyed. Alright, uh, let's see what other equipment we have. Where's the shop guy? Do you? No. Uh, which one? Which one had the shop? One of these was. One of these had the shop. I forget which which one was the shopkeeper, but it was one of these people. It's not down here. Ah, uh, I need some items. Like seriously, I really need some items. Was it you? No. Maybe it was one of, maybe it was this person. Yes, I have money. Okay, here we go. Alright, um... That wouldn't help. That would not help. I think I have all the stuff. Um... How many, okay, well, I definitely want a couple Athenian waters. Um, I'm gonna want more potions as well. Let's try and, let's get like 15 potions. So you all get one more, just so you have an even 20. Um, let's see. Yeah, I pretty much have all the stuff. In that case, let's just grind up to level 10 for um, Luca and Marl, and then we'll take on the boss again. And I know where to grind, too. Alright. So I believe in order to grind, we want to go over here. And we want to go out. And if I remember correctly, there's a pretty good grinding spot over here. I mean, there's a lot of enemies in, in the other area, but I think a better grinding spot is right over here. Let me actually save first. Yep. Beyond the ruins. Alright, so let's head into Site 16 and see if we can take on some enemies. Any enemies? No? There we go. If I can get level 10 for both of these, I'll be- both of these peeps, I'll be fine. Alright, let's see what we can do. Alright, let's combo Wind Slash. Ah, Chrono Trigger, the first RPG that got me into RPGs. Welcome, Soan. Thank you so much for stopping by. We're just playing- we're, this is my first time playing the game, so- Oh! Well, there's Luca's level increased. I'm just trying to grind for a little bit to get everyone up to level 10 so I can take on the next boss. Um... Stone! Okay. Gotcha. Sorry for the mispronunciation there. Alright, I want to take on U3. Possible. There we go. 
My apologies for the mispronunciation. All right. Gotcha. All right. So use uh, so use Wind Slash on you two. That'll do a decent amount of damage. Take him out. And uh, use Flamethrower. I should take this guy out. I should be close to level 10 for all three of them. No, not quite for Luca. Need to grind a little bit more. No, he stole a potion. I hate when that happens. All right, let's combo. Uh, let's use a Cyclone. And I will use Flamethrower on you two. And I'll just attack, whatever. Mario mostly has healing spells from what I can tell. Alright. See what we can do. Let's do, uh, let's do Fire Whirl. And I'll just, uh, do that. There we go. Hopefully it'll take out these enemies. I'll just, I'll just do regular attacks. That should be enough to get these guys out of here. Alright. Alright, there we go. And yeah, regular attacks should be enough to take them out. Alright, nice. Nice! Marl's level increased. Alright, uh, where are we at in terms of levels? Okay, we're at level 10 for everyone. That should be enough to try and beat the boss again. So let's try that again. If I have to fight- okay, if I have to fight these guys again, that's no big deal. I'll, I'll get some more experience, so that's fine. Alright. And we'll use Flamethrower. And I'll just attack. There we go. This is good for getting some experience. Definitely could use it. Alright. Because that boss kicked my butt the first time I did that. That was not great. Alright, now I gotta fight you. Alright. I'm gonna wait for the combo. Alright, and let's use Fire Whirl, and I'll just attack. Fire Whirl is so good. Alright, let's do that. Ow! No, you're stealing my health! Alright, let's do another combo. Alright, and Fire Whirl again, and I'll just attack. Alright, come on. 166, there we go. Nice. Alright, well, let's take on the boss again. It's right up here. Alright, I'm gonna go over here, save the game. Nice. And then go in here. And basically, let's rest up at the Enertron. I, I love that idea of an Enertron. It gives you a full night's sleep in a couple seconds. Oh, how lovely that would be. Rest of the Enertron, yes. Nice. <laughs> but you're still just hungry before. Alright, let's try beating this boss again, because we got our butts kicked last time. I'm guessing you want to take out the sentries first. I mean, that would make sense, but I don't know. What I'm scared about is if they respawn. That sounds like a disaster. Is there anything over here, actually? So it seems like there would be. No, nothing over here? Alright, well, let's just take on the boss again. We'll see if we can do a little bit better this time. This freaking boss. Alright, let's try again. Alright, so let's get a combo going. Yeah, I'm guessing the sentries we want to take out first. Alright. Jesus Christ, alright. Alright, let's do... let's do Fire Whirl on you. And let's try using... Um, I have a feeling it's not gonna work. Let's try using Allure on the on the main boss. Like I said, this is probably not gonna work. Okay, that didn't work. Yeah, we need to take out them before, before they do that. Because Delta Attack does a lot of damage. Alright, so let's do a combo of Aura Whirl. We can revive everyone's health quite a bit. And let's use Flamethrower on this guy. This seems to be working. Alright, good. He's dead. So now he can't do the Delta Triangle attack. Let's do Fire Whirl on the other sentry, because I really want to take that out too. Alright, Amplifier. What does that do? Oh, jeez. Alright, that did, that did quite a lot. 
Um, let's just uh, let's just attack you, and I'll combo wind slash on you. All right, nice. I have a feeling that's healing that an enemy. So, all right, I'm definitely I'm gonna use a potion. Yeah, I'm using a potion on Chrono because that's not good. All right, so let's combo Fire Whirl on this, and then I'm gonna use a potion on Chrono if I can. If I can. There we go. Nice. All right. Now we should be okay for now. So let's combo again. Let's use Fire Whirl. Bye. Uh-oh. Is it counting down? I didn't mean to do that, but that, that works too. That way I'll heal some of my uh, own health. For Oh, geez. What is that? Uh, let's do that. Let's use another. Let's use another potion on Chrono. There. <sighs> I'm sweating a little bit. I, I don't like. I don't like what that countdown is. All right, we need to go all out now. All right, come on. Zero. What is it gonna do? Oh, it revised the pods, I understand. Okay. So, all right, but now we need to take out the pods again. I understand what it does. So yeah, this is bad. This is gonna do a lot of damage. All right, let's take out the pods. All right, let's do Aura Whirl. And let's do Flamethrower on that. There we go. Chrono's almost out of MP though, which is concerning. All right, let's just attack the uh, pods now. We'll, however, use Flamethrower on you. All right, let's see. Okay, that pod is dead, thank God. All right, yeah, Amplifier does a lot. Yeah, Mar Marl's weapon seems to do quite a lot. All right, uh, all right, so let's do, let's attack you. And let's use an item on Marl. Let's use a potion there. And then I'll use flamethrower. Take out the pods, all right, cool. All right, I'm gonna use a combo. Let's use a fire whirl. All right, and then I'm gonna use an ether on Chrono. That way I can revive his MP. Let's do some more. There, Fire Whirl. And let's Aura on Chrono. Alright, there we go. Alright, almost all the pods are gonna be back soon, so let's try and take him out. Yeah, that's doing... Oh, that's not doing anything, actually, yeah. You're right, the, the, the attacks aren't doing anything. I guess I can't combo them. Yeah, you're right. It's it's the normal weapons. I gotta stop... All right, I think, I, I think if I go into this battle again, I'll understand what's going on. All right, yeah. I think he's immune to fire or something like that, if I had to guess. That being said, I'm probably dead, actually. All right. Yeah, I need to... I'm probably dead because I, you know, didn't get a chance to revive myself. But let's try that again. So yeah, Marl's dead. Alright, so we're gonna we're gonna do this battle one more time. And I think I should be able to get it this time. Because I just didn't understand what I was supposed to do. Alright, so we died. But thanks for pointing that out, Shivas. I wasn't... I didn't get that the attacks weren't doing anything. So let's, let's try that again. Because I'm sure we can get it this time. All right, see what we can do. All right. See, so yeah, we definitely we need to use our combos. Um, on. I wonder what wind does against that guy. I'm curious. Thank, I will hydrate in a minute. Um. All right. So let's attack that one and that one. There we go. That's doing a lot of damage. Nice. All right. 
Alright, let's use Aura. Actually, no. Let's, yeah, let's use Aura on, on uh, Luca, and then I'll use... Let me try using Wind Slash on this and see what that does. 74. Okay, so Wind is definitely the way to go. So, not, not Fire Wave. Alright, so let's use Flamethrower on you. And Wind Slash on you. All right, there we go. That does that does a lot of damage. All right, I need to heal Chrono ASAP. So I'm going to use an item. I'm going to use a potion on Chrono. And I'm going to use Wind Slash and... How are you not dead yet? Seriously. Um, Flamethrower. Uh, I need to use a potion. There we go. I'm gonna use another potion. And wind slash. There we go. I need to take care of that stupid sentry though. Alright, flamethrower. Let's try a cyclone on this guy, see what happens. Okay, good. Now I can heal a little bit. Wow, that did a lot of- okay, we're definitely using Cyclone. Um, Aura on Chrono. Cyclone. Alright. And, uh, let's just- let's just attack. Cyclone. And, attack. Alright, there we go. So, almost back. So I'm gonna do, well, let's use Cyclone, and then let's attack, and then here I'm gonna use uh, Aura on there. That should work. All right. All right, so the pods are revived. All right, not bad. Although, crap, he's doing this now. So let's use Aura Wave. And I'm gonna take out the pods. Alright, so Aura Wave, or Aura Whirl, and then Flamethrower. There we go. There we go. Alright, we need to do that. Alright, let's use, um. Alright, let's use Fire Whirl on this guy. Let's use Aura. No, let's use a let's use a potion. Oh no. Actually no, let's, let's use let's use a mid ether on uh Chrono. There we go. And then Fire Whirl. Alright, now I'm starting to get the hang of this. Potion. Alright, there we go. I don't like that amplifier move though, it's doing a lot of damage. Alright, so... Whoops, not yet. Alright, Fire Whirl. Nope. And attack. I'll just attack that since I think the pod is going to be dead at this point. Yeah, okay. Alright, so... Cyclone. Attack. Attack. Alright, so now I need to basically go all out on attacking, although I am going to heal Chrono. Alright. Uh, yeah, Potion on Chrono. What is- oh! Wait, what's Breakdown? Is that the end? Is that it? Yo, I think we won! Let's go! Third time's the charm! I'll gladly take it. Thousand gold. We win! Let's go! Alright, that was that was a pretty intense boss. Uh, where did I put my water bottles? Oh, here we go. Um, Crone, I, or Sone, as you are- sorry, I don't know why I said Crone. I was about to say Crono, but... Sone, since you are new, uh, every time someone tells me to hydrate, I have to drink from this giant water bottle. So, this is known as the comically oversized water bottle, or Kaub, just to- just to explain that. Yeah, it's a bit of a bit of an in joke. <laughs> All 
I'm, I'm, I'm so annoyed that I was going to say crone. It's like, no, not chrono. I meant sewn, as in the person in my chat. I, and yes, I will definitely pass a check. Jeez, that was a, that was an interesting boss fight, actually. I like that. All right, so let's go up here. Yo, the food. Yuck, something reeks. Everything's completely rotten. The refrigeration must have failed. Chrono, look! He's not breathing. Must have died down there. There's something in his hand. What do you suppose this is? Huh. It looks like some kind of seed. A seed? Could it even grow in a place like this? A note is written on a soiled scrap of paper. That rat is more than just a statue. It knows the secret of this dome. Catch it. Let's oh, enter this. Obtained mid-ether. Well, that's nice. Don't quite know what that means, though. That rat is more than just a statue. It knows the secret of this dome. Catch it. Well, I guess we might as well go back and tell the other people the bad news, but that's a bit yikes. All right, well, let's go down here. There! That must be it! It might run away. Run after it and press A to catch it. Oh, so we gotta catch the rat. Got it. I got it! Squeak, I give up! I'll tell you everything, Squeak. Press A, Y, then B to activate the switch, and once you hear the sound, Squeak... Oh. Alright, well, I guess that explains a lot. I think I know what it's talking about. Yep, I know. A, Y, then B. Alright, I think I think I know what, is, what, what it's referring to. So let's head back down here. And now, now we know the password. Oh, wait, hang on. No? I thought it was AYB. Hold on. Oh, I see. Hold on. Let me go back up and try again. No? Hold on, what's up with this? I'm a little confused. Where's that rat? Hmm. It said A, Y, B, but I'm not quite sure what I'm doing there. Right? I'm pretty sure it said A, Y, B. No? No? Okay, this is getting weird. Hang on a second. Oh, you, I don't think it- I don't think that's the confirmation sound. Because I can't get over there. I feel like I'm doing something wrong. Hang on. I'm look. I I have my guide in case I get stuck. Hold on. Well, apparently I have to press. According to this, I press L R and A. No. Well, this is weird. Hold on. Yeah, it didn't activate the bridge. What am I supposed to do? Careful then and come back alive. No, that's what he already said before. I feel like I'm doing this wrong. Hang on. Hold on. No. 
No? I'm so confused. Like, seriously, I do not understand what you're supposed to do here. Let me read that thing up here again. Because I am legitimately confused as to what you're supposed to do. Let me try catching the rat again. I know the confirmations. That's not the confirmation sound because... Hold on. Let me read this again. All right. Maybe now I can catch the rat again. Press A, Y, then B. Yeah, I'm doing that, but it's not working correctly. A, Y, then B to activate the switch, and once you hear the sound, squeak. Is it A and Y, then B? Oh, A, okay, I guess maybe it's A, Y, th A, A, and Y, and then B. That is so strange that this isn't working correctly. Hmm. Not quite sure how this is supposed to work. Yeah, I'm not doing this right. Hold on. I'm pressing that. I, I, what, what? Hold on, this is not, something is not right here. Something is definitely not right here. I, I feel like I'm doing this wrong, but I, I, I definitely need to do this. I'm very confused. Hold on. I guess I should save first because I did just beat a boss, but clearly this is how you're supposed to progress with the plot. And I'm super lost. Hold on, let me save. Save data. Nice. Hmm. I... I am definitely missing something here. Pressing L, R, and A. Then L, R, and... Or I'm pressing A, then Y, then B, and it's not doing anything. What? I... I'm... I am so confused. I'm, I... What? I need to look this up, because I, I don't know what you're supposed to do here. Like, I, it, it must be something that I'm missing here. He gave me A, Y, and B. Because apparently a bridge should form over here that lets me get to the door, but it's not working correctly. Hold on. Hold on a second. I'm looking this up because I do not understand. Sorry I'm wasting so much time, but... I, I just... I genuinely do not know what you're supposed to do here. Hold on. What? 
I don't... I don't know what it means by A, Y, and B. I'm pressing A, Y, and B and it's not working. And I'm, and I'm, and I'm, and the guides say to use L, R, and A. Like, am I, am I missing something here? I, I genuinely don't know what to do. Like, I'm, I'm genuinely confused. What? Hold on, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta check the, uh, hold on, settings. Like, am I missing something here? Because I can't, I legitimately cannot, I legitimately cannot get past this. That seemed right, and I got a, a sound for that, but what do I do now? Like, I, I can't press Y. I'm press- I can press A correctly, but I can't do Y. Like, am I- am I just stuck here? Is that it? Maybe if I try doing this with the- with the- with, by disconnecting the controller, maybe that'll work. That's the only thing I could think of, because it- I keep trying this and it's not working correctly. Hold on, let me save. I'm wasting so much time. Um, I'm gonna exit out of the game real quick and I'm gonna re-enter it without a controller and see if the uh, controls are different. Maybe that'll help it a little bit. This is genuinely like confounding. For some reason, I, I just can't get the right button combination. All right, hopefully you guys can see it again. All right, let me try this. All right, um. Uh, what, what is, it? yes. All right, I'm using a keyboard now. Let's see if this works a little bit better. I'm hoping this works better because I, I don't know what else to do. All right. And then after this, I'll switch back to the controller, but I don't know how else to do this. Hold on, let me let me see how do I how do I pause the game? Crap. Which button is pause? Is it escape? Is it space? Great. Well, now I don't know what button is pause. So now I don't know what my controls are. Is it V? Okay, it's V. All right. So no. No, I want to exit out of it. No, I don't want to do that at all. Okay, wait. Settings. Controls. Gamepad settings. Okay, um. All right, so I guess, hold on. This is so confounding. All right, this is so weird. All right. A, Y, then B. What does that mean? It's not telling me anything else. It says A, Y, then B, but it doesn't help anything. It, it keeps saying A, Y, then B, but I have no idea what that means.
Okay, well, not using the controller didn't help, so let's get the controller back online. What? Guys, I, I might be stuck here because I genuinely am lost. Hold on. Hold on. Does it want all three of them? It wants all three of them. It wanted all three of them at the same time. That's what it was. I'm so dumb. All right, well, let's let's just fight these guys. Now I'm, now I'm a little annoyed. <laughs> I didn't understand it wanted all three of them. All right, let's use uh, Fire Whirl. Dang it. It wanted all three buttons at the same time. That's why it didn't work. Oh, I feel so stupid. Get out of here. Ow. Thankfully, I saved before this, so that's good. Thank you, Shavis. I really appreciate it. Ah, I wasted so much time doing that. All right, well, we got a mid ether at least. That's nice. Uh, let's go up here. Fight some more of these guys. All right, let's use uh, Wind Slash. I will definitely hydrate after that. Just let me finish this battle real quick. Right, I'm gonna use uh, I'm gonna use an aura on Chrono because he's getting a little too uh, low on HP, and then I'll just attack these guys. There we go. There we go. Go. What does that do? Ha ha! You missed. Nice. And I got a panacea. That'll be useful. Let's fight some more of them, just so I can, uh, take all these guys out. Alright, all right, so what is that trying to do? Because it keeps missing. Oh, it puts you to sleep! Uh-oh. Well, that's not good. Alright. Um, let me use Wind Slash. Come on. Get out of here. Wind Slash! Nice. Oh, wait. All right. Attack. Man, I should have used Hypno Wave. That would have been helpful. All right. Get up, Marl. At least, I got an, oh, at least Luca's level increased. That's nice. All right. Let's go down here. Oh, geez. A robot. Really should have healed first. That would have been smart. Um, I guess we can take on the robot, see what happens. Alright. Cyclone. Oh yeah, let me hydrate, hang on. Or, after this battle, I guess. Alright, uh, flamethrower. Hey, that's not nice. Alright, well the robot's not too bad. Let me hydrate real quick. Paint a potion, nice. All right, that's good. Let's see what's going on up here. All right, another robot. Um, sure, we can take the robot on. All right, Cyclone. I'll try to heal after this fight because I notice I'm a little low on health. All right, flamethrower. Let's attack. Here we go. Nice. Nice! Alright. I'll definitely take that. I got another potion. Alright, so let's use one of those potions. Uh, potion. And I want to use it on uh, Chrono. There we go. That should be enough. Alright, see what else is up here. 
Nothing up here. Oh, wait. There's a chest. Oh, there's another button over there. I don't know what that's going to do. Uh, let's go in here first. Oh, what's this? This must be the supercomputer. Good, it's still operational. If we want to search on temporal distortions, we might just find our gate. Got it! East of here. Alright, where's the gate? Oh, geez, it's pretty far east. Gotcha. There, Protodome. Leave it to Luca. Who'd have thought this machine could tell us something like that? Say, what does this button do? Why would you press that? 1999 AD. Visual world record of the day of Lavos. Hmm. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. What the heck? Is that a volcano? What the... That doesn't sound good. He's raining fire on everyone. What, what was that? Lavos, is that what destroyed the world? Then this is, this really is our future? No, it can't be, I won't believe it. This, this can't be the way the world ends. Hmm. Chrono. Hey, that's right, we can change it. Change history, just like Chrono did when he saved me. We have to. Right, Luca? Right, Chrono? Well, I don't know how to change the world. That sounds like Maverick talk to me. Yeah, I guess so. And fortunately, we've got gates that will let us move through time. What do you say, Chrono? I have a feeling if we say no way, we'll be in a butt thou must situation, so yeah. Okay, let's do it. All right, it's set. Chrono, Luca, let's do this. First things first, let's get back to our own time period to see if we can find any information about this Lavos. Next stop, Protodome. Yep, let's head off. Although I do want to go over there. So I might take on a few more of these robots. I'll take on this robot at least. Okay. All right, I, I think normal attacks should be able to take care of this guy. There we go. I want to see what's in that, um, all right, there's a potion. But I really want to see what's over here. Oh, geez. Uh... There we go. I was like, we must be able to get over here. A curious crest is engraved here, and a mysterious forest seals it shut. Oh, right, I guess we can't go in there. Bunch of rats over there. Yeah, we need to head back to our own time period. Alright, want to be careful of those guys. Gotta get out of here. I think it's this way. Nice. Alright, well now we got a couple of enemies. I guess we'll take on some of these enemies. Normal attack should be able to take them out. Nice! 174 damage. Alright. What we can do. 80. Nice. Earn 52 XP and Panacea. Nice. And Marl's level increase, too. Excellent. Alright, I don't feel like taking on too many more enemies because I'd rather stock up on some items and whatnot. Although I will take on this guy, I guess. Alright. Ow! Alright, uh, let's attack. Uh, let's do that, let's do that, and then for you, I'm gonna use Aura on Luca just to make sure she doesn't die, or not. Alright. I like this music, though, it's very bombastic. Alright. So up here, 
And let's talk to these guys. You, you're back. Well, I hate to break it to you, but there's no food in sight, unfortunately. And what did you discover? This, this is our future. Hmm? Who cares? Where's the food? This was the only thing left. A seed. You don't know how long that Enertron will hold out. This seed might be your only hope. Anyway, just stay alive. Don't give up. We won't either. Hmm. You're a strange bunch. So you're different from us somehow. You mean because we haven't lost hope? Hope. There's a word I haven't heard in a long time. But it does have a comforting ring to it, though. I don't know what kind of seed this is, but I'll do my best to grow it. Hey, Mr. Bones. How you doing? We're playing some Chrono Trigger. What's that? This may just be this may be just the thing we needed. You're off to Protodome then. You'll need to pass through site 32. Take this with you. Obtain jet bike key. It's a it's a key it's the key to the jet bike part that the site 32 ruins. I used it to ride it while I was young. Hopefully it still works. They've gotten even more powerful robots in that dome and they've overrun the place. Take care and don't give up hope. I'll be sure not to. I need you to move, though, because otherwise I literally cannot... I was about to say, I want to get to the Anertron, yes. There we go. Yes, I know I'm still as hungry as before. Let me save real quick. And let me buy some stuff. Alright, so buy, I want to buy some potions. Let's get back up to 20. And I want to get... Um, let's see. I want to get a couple... I want to get one more Athenian water and two two more shelters. And I think we're good. Uh, no, not really, Mr. Bones. I'm guessing we'll probably beat Mega Man Zero next time because we're pretty close to beating it. But, oh, you mean if, we, if we're talking about the whole series? Yes, it'll be a while. He's talking about the uh, other stream series that I'm doing right now, which is Mega Man Zero ZX Legacy Collection. All right, um, what exactly was I supposed to do next? Hang on. I want to get up my guide again, just to make sure I know what I'm doing. Um, give me a second. I'm just trying to make sure I do this right. So where exactly is Lab 32? Is it over here? This is the abandoned sewers. This is Site-32. Hold on. Um, I'm a little confused as to where Lab-32 is. Is it through the abandoned sewers? I feel like it might be. I remember there's a shortcut we can take. If we go down here, and then down here. There's some enemies, though. I don't feel like fighting them. Oh, just go to Site-32? Alright, we'll just go there. That would make sense, but I don't know if they're one and the same. Alright, let's head over to Site-32 then. Well, I don't know if this is quite the same. Hang on, let me, let me check something. Okay, yeah, they are the same. <laughs> Site 32 is the same thing as Lab 32. Gotcha, gotcha. Crashes through the window. Welcome, in Focus. I'm in the right spot. All right, cool. So then let's find our way around here. Oh, hey, a jet bike. What the heck? Uh-oh, we got some robots. Gotta take them out. Wait, what? Hold it right there. Oh. Bro. Thanks for the intro, boys. Bro. You loafies can call me Johnny. I'm the leader of this pack. Now listen up. The ruined highway up ahead is the only road you've got. You want to reach the other side? You're going to have to ride in a race against me, that is. I'll teach you how to use that jet bike, because that's the kind of guy I am. Don't sweat it, and don't you dare chicken out, babe. 
Uh, trash man redeem highlight my message and says tick tock my clock is wonk. That's basically this entire game's plot <laughs> All right, so, I, so do you shiny axles know how to ride? I love this guy and no I do not know how to use a jet bike All right, listen up and let Johnny tell you how it's done The gas is on auto so there's only one speed fast to steer just press the up and down directional buttons Tap the B button for turbo boost. I'll give you three of them. The B icons show how many you've got left Heads up though, after you use one, you can't use another until the gauge above the icons refills. You can check your position from the finish line on the screen. Now show me what you got, babe. Well, let's do it. Whoa, this looks awesome! Okay, this is really cool. Yo, this, look at this Mode 7, though. This Mode 7 looks great. Okay, this is seriously awesome. That might have been a mistake. Oh, I lost. Damn it. Okay, I should have dashed at the end. My bad. Bro, bro, he's so fast. You came in dead last. Give it up. Go home. Ha! What a joke! If that's the best you can do, you can walk your way across the ruins. Better watch out, watch out for all those monsters, though. Right again if you think you can handle it, chump. So yeah, let's try that again. Alright, let's try that again, because that was awesome. I just completely failed it, is the main thing. Alright. I guess I gotta try and get ahead of him. But this is seriously cool. Nitro Man is commanding a bunch of crab robots. <laughs> Although to be fair, this game came out in like 1990 something. I forget the exact year. I wonder if this came out before or after Mega Man X. I'm kind of curious about that. All right, yeah, I gotta block him off a bunch. Oh! Okay, I won. That was really close though. Jeez, that is a good time for a clip. Oof! I was a little nervous I was going to fail that. Mr. Bones who didn't highlight my message, he says, Damn, didn't know some call me Johnny turned into a Reploid Transformer hybrid. <laughs> nice, I beat him. That was, an, that was really cool. You don't beat me. You beat me? I don't get it. Well, you can come challenge me again anytime. We'll ride the wind, babe. Alright, that was pretty awesome. Alright, now if I remember correctly... The portal should be over here, by the Proto-Dome. Alright, what's this? Derelict Factory. I have a feeling we don't want to go there yet, and I will definitely hydrate. 2300 AD, wow! Now that is far in the future. Like, remember, these guys came from 1000 AD. Imagine going to 2300 AD. Alright, let me definitely save on the, on the world map real quick. We go. Alright, I guess we should head into the Proto Dome. This Johnny guy is as slick as a lick. <laughs> Alright, let's take out some more robots. Alright. So he's Cyclone. Oh, that, that way I can take out all three of them at once. Um, I'll just use a flamethrower. And I'll attack. Actually, that might kill them all. Triple kill! <laughs> nice. All right, we got more of these guys. All right, let's see what we can do. Let's do let's do another cyclone because that took out a lot of them. Let's use Hypno Wave against all of them though. Maybe I can put one of them to sleep. There we go. That did not work as planned. I although to be to be completely fair, I you probably cannot hypnotize robots, so that that does make sense. I don't think that's... I don't think that's how that works. So, fair enough, I guess. I, I should have thought of that. <laughs> Nitro Man co commanding other... Uh, I love the references to Nitro Man from uh, Mega Man 10. Uh, well, here's the Enertron. HP and MP restored. Nice. But you're still as hungry as before. Alright, what's over here? What do you have to say for yourself? 
What's this thing? It's in bad shape, but it looks like a humanoid robot. Incredible. What are you doing, Luca? Hmm, I think I can fix it. What? Fix it? What if it attacks us like the other ones? I'll make sure it won't. Robots don't attack of their own free will, you know. They only do it because humans make them that way. Luca, you really feel for them, don't you? I better get to work. How do you still have tools when we time travel? I am very confused. The door won't budge. All right, that should do it. I'm gonna give it some juice. Yo, look at him go. Hmm. Good morning. Good, good, good morning, mistress. What is your command? I'm not your mistress, I'm Morrow. Uh, that's some interesting wording there. This is Chrono, and that's Luca, the one who fixed you. Understood. Madam Luca restored my circuits. Just Luca will do. That manner of address could potentially cause offense. I am incapable of offensive speech. <laughs> wow. Well, some of us don't like it when people are so formal all the time. Isn't that right, Marl? Hee <laughs> hee. Understood, Luca. All right, so what's your name? Name? Perhaps you are referring to my serial number. My serial number is R66Y. R66Y? Cool. Cool? What are you talking about? That won't do at all. Come on, Krona, let's give him a better name. Okay, so I guess his default name is Robo, although, and I, and I have been going with default names the whole time, although, I will admit, I am half tempted to name him Mega Man, just for the hell of it. But, like I said, we are doing default names all the way through, so Robo it is. Yeah, Robo. Yes, Robo, that's perfect. Your, your, your new name is Robo, okay? My name is Robo. Data storage complete. Hey, Robo, there's something I was hoping you could... Hmm. What happened here? This dome contained many humans and others like me. Oh dear, this is kind of hard to say, but I think something awful happened while you were out. I, I don't think anyone else has left. Hmm. I see. What about yourselves? There's an optional party member later on. Okay. We came through a gate, uh, a time warp from the year 1000. We learned that there was a gate here when we went to the Aris Dome. And when we found you, we came looking for the gate. But the door to the inner chamber is sealed shut, so it looks like we're out of luck. The dome's power has been shut off completely. The factory to the north contains an emergency power generator for this dome. I can bypass security to activate it. Shall we go there? You'd do that for us? You repaired me, now it is my turn to be of assistance. However, the generator will produce power for only a short time. Someone must remain here to open the door as soon as power is restored to the dome. Marl or I can stay. Who will stay behind? Oh, geez. Now I have to choose? Is there is there like a story difference if I choose one or the other? I'm a little concerned about that. Hold on. Um, all right. I guess I have to stay one of have one of them stay behind. Uh I'm gonna have Marl stay behind because I think I'd be I should be able to heal myself using potions, so Marl. Okay, be careful, Chrono. Alright, so now I have Robo. Now I have Robo, Luca, and uh and Chrono, which will be useful. Not a difference. Namely who you want to stay behind while bringing Robo. How what level is Robo? Okay, Lo Robo is level 10, that's fair. So, alright, so now we go out here again. And I guess we head up to that factory over there. Right? The uh, derelict factory. I mean, that would make sense. Alright. Let's see. Override security system zero zero. Uh-oh, time for a battle against, what is that, one creature? Uh, let's try Rocket Punch. 
Ow! Get rocket punched! Okay, that is up. Three damage! What the hell? That's nothing! Oh, I guess all of my attacks aren't doing much, so... Because that only did four damage. What was that? Come on! Alright, uh, I guess I have to go up here then. Oh, well, guess I'm fighting these guys. <laughs> Alright, uh... Let's see. Alright, let's use Fire Whirl on this guy. And I'll just attack normally. The ultimate trio. Swordman, Junkman, and Auto. Oh my god. Alright. Let's see what we can do. Alright, well, let's just do normal attacks for now. That ought to work. Get out of here. Is there a way to avoid battles? Yes! If you press L and R, you will run away from battles. However, I don't want to do that because I want to get as much experience as possible. Yeah, the, the soundtrack in this game is incredible. For sure. Alright, um, what do I want to do here? Left laboratory, right factory. Danger, risk of death, deactivation of factory conveyor belt forbidden. Stopping the belt will, act will activate the security system, which will result in a loss of life. So, I guess I want to go to the factory, question mark? Hold on. I guess I'm going to the factory. Yep, let's go to the factory. All right, well, there's a chest over there, so that's nice. Let's, let's grab that. Anything over here? Oh. No, it doesn't look like it. I want to grab that chest, though. What does this do? There's a barrel over there. Hmm. How do we progress? I guess I can go over here, then. A lot of robots being made. Oh, here's another chest. We got a bandit's bow. Can, I, can anyone equip that? Uh, let me see. Equipment. No, I, I think that's for Marl, actually. So let's, let's save that for Marl. Let's see. Hmm. I wonder how I get that, that thing over there. There's nothing I can do over here. It doesn't look like it, at least. It looks like I have to go all the way around to get over there. Let's see what's down here. Hmm. All right. Let's see what's in here. Hmm. What the? Uh-oh. Uh, I guess I'm fighting a robot. I don't know what I did there, but clearly I did something wrong. Ow. Let's try using the other special, the heal beam. That might that might prove to be useful. Yeah, let's definitely use heal beam on the uh, on Robo. So yes, yeah, use cure beam or sorry, cure beam. But wow, that that heals a lot. Although that probably also costs a lot, but that's interesting. Robo learn laser spin. Ooh, I wonder what that is. All right, well, I guess this uh, conveyor belt will take us somewhere. Oh, looks like we're fighting a gauntlet of enemies. All right, uh, oh, supersonic spin. What is this? Whoa, okay, that is awesome. That was, that was really cool. That's true, it, since it is a factory, it makes sense that you find a lot of robots here. A little worried about Chrono's health though, so. All right, so let's, 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 let's use a, um, let's use Wind Slash, or let's use Cyclone on these three. I'll use, um, I'll use Cure Beam on Chrono. And, oh, guess I'm not using Cure Beam on Chrono. Mr. Bones would highlight a message and says another Steam gift on the freaking phone. Another Steam gift on the house for you. Since you've been doing a great job at the Reddit and Discord along with the others. Aw, thank you, Mr. Bones. I really appreciate that. I'll check out what it is in a moment. Uh-oh. 
All right, I need to use Cure Beam on Chrono ASAP because I'm going to be screwed. All right, uh... Hypno Wave, I guess? I need to I need to do something, because Chrono's gonna die otherwise. There we go. See if I can put at least some of them to sleep. Damn it! Hypnosis does not work on robots! Supersonic spin! Spinning around at the speed of sound! Nice! All right, well now Luca's not doing great. All right. All right, yeah, I need to, I need to heal. All right, uh, Fire Whirl. And then I'm gonna use Cure Beam on uh, Luca. The robots definitely want Chrono dead. You are right about that. All right, Cure Beam on, oh great, Luca's actually dead. That's a problem. I only need to heal her after this. All right, let's do that, and I'll use Cure Beam on uh, on Robo there. All right, definitely a little worried. All right, I need to use, um, I don't want to auto battle. All right, well, at least we're down here. All right, uh, oh, okay, I guess Luca gets revived. I guess that's how that works, at one HP. Um. No, I want to use I want to use a potion. Yeah, I want to use a potion. There we go. I'll use two potions to get Luca back up. Anything down here? A couple of enemies. Uh, I guess I should use it. I'll use another potion then. Actually, no. I should be able to heal Luca in the battle. Let's do this. All right. So let's use Cyclone, and then I'll heal myself. I hid myself while I repaired myself. All right, can I please attack if you don't mind? Thank you. Actually, that might kill them all, crap. No, I don't wanna, okay, well that was a bit of a mistake because I wanted to heal both Robo and Luca, but did not get the chance to. At least I got a Panacea. One of them dies or something like that. All right, let's see. Well, now we're up here. At least I can now get that chest. We got a mid potion. Well, that's useful. Um, I'm actually gonna use a, um, I'm gonna use the more regular potions though. I'm gonna use it on both of these two. There we go. Nice. All right, what's up here? More chests. We get a mid ether and I know. No, I want to grab the other one. 400 gold, well that's nice. Can I interact with these robots? No. All right, well at least this is, I guess we, I guess we got some money, that's useful. All right, what's down here? Nothing over here, Not just a barrel. What's up here? More enemies, all right, let's take them out. All right, let's do, let's do supersonic spin. I love doing this. Although I am a little low on MP, so I need to be careful about that. All right, uh, let's use Flamethrower, because Hypno Wave doesn't work, dang it. You can't hypnotize robots. All right. Let's see, 15. Uh, let's do another combo, let's do Fire Whirl this time. And for tech, I'll use laser spin. I'm kind of curious to see what the regular laser spin does. Or not, I guess we'll do that next time. Oh well. All right. I'll definitely take a look after this, Mr. Bones. What, there's another one? All right, let's just attack this guy. I'll use uh, laser spin on you. Oh, that is cool. That is really cool. All right, and then flamethrowers should take you out. Get out of here. No! Get out of here. Just some slashes for you. There we go. Nice. All right. Let's get an ether and a shelter. That'll be, that'll be useful. To activate the crane, wait for the tone and white flash, then press any two of Y, B, X, and A, one after the next. Oh, no.
All right, so why X B than A? Nope, that, that is, this is gonna be annoying. Dang it. So just press any two of Y, X, B, and A, one after the next. Dang it, all right, let me, let me actually heal real quick. Or let me, not really heal, but get some inventory. I wanna use my uh, ether on, uh, I wanna use some ethers. There we go. Hold on. Wait for the tone and white flash, then press any two of Y, X, B, and A, one after the next. What? I feel like I'm doing this right. There we go. All right, so what is that crane gonna do? Oh, I guess it'll just remove the barrel. Okay, well, that's useful, I suppose. Thanks. I'm gonna have to fight those enemies again, though, which is a little annoying. All right, thanks, Crane. All right, can I get past fighting these? Okay. Oh, I actually ran away from them. All right. Um, yeah, I don't feel like fighting them right now, I'll be honest. Did lose quite a lot of uh, stuff over there. All right. Uh, okay, so in here, what's this? Thunderblade! That looks like an item for Chrono. Um, actually, yeah, I already, I guess I equipped it already, but nice. Definitely very happy about that. All right, what is this going to do? Ultra high security door system lock code. X-A-B-Y. I'm actually going to write that down real quick because I feel like I'm going to forget it otherwise. It is X-A-B-Y. Cool. Decoding. A-B-Y-X. Okay. Do I press all of them at the same time, or...? Not really sure what that does. Or what I'm supposed to do with that. Hmm, interesting. Now what do I do? Because up here was nothing. Yeah, there's nothing up here, but... Actually, wait, was there something in there? No. And those robots aren't active either. All right, so now we got to figure out where to go. Do I have to fight those guys again? Hold on, let me let me double check this. Hold on. Okay, so yeah, I need I need to go all the way back then. Gotcha. All right, well I'm gonna have to fight these guys. So let's take them out. All right, I'll use a uh, cyclone. That's doing a lot of damage though. Ha ha, you miss. You don't want to use the heal spell in a minute. That did a decent amount. Actually, that might take them all out. Okay, there we go. Nice. Nice. Oh, and ro both Lu uh, Robo and Lucas level increased. Excellent. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go back on the conveyor belt again. All right, uh, let me see. Do I need to heal at all? Uh, yeah, I want to heal Chrono. Uh, I'll, I'll give everyone one potion. That should be enough. All right, let's go. What the? Where are you taking me? This crane is... Oh, I guess it's just... Oh, gee, he's got to fight more enemies. All right, let's see what we can do. All right, this is not going too well. Let's see. Yeah, I gotta get through these sets of enemies. Ow! That did a lot of damage. Ow! All right, there we go. Get rocket punched. There we go. Whew! Definitely want to stock up on items, that's for sure. All right, looks like we got to ride along these conveyor belts for now. All right, let's see what we can do. Let's, uh, let's combo supersonic spin. And I'll just use flamethrower. All 
Actually, that might... Alright, that didn't take them all out, but this will be nice. Alright, flamethrower. Come on. Alright, come on, take them out. I think there's usually... I think there's three battles in a row for this. Alright, there we go. So I think there should be one more battle. At least I'm getting experience, which is nice. All right, and here's the big battle with like a ton of enemies. All right, let's use Cyclone. All right, nice. Ow. And let's use, uh, let's use Fire Whirl. And I'm gonna use uh, Cure Beam on Chrono. There we go. Hopefully it'll take these guys out. Nice. And Cure Beam. And that should be enough for now. Might need to heal Luca in the next battle, though. Nice! Alright, come on. 69. And dead. Excellent. Alright, please let that be the last battle. Is there another battle? Please don't let there be another battle. Wait, that didn't do anything. That just sent me back here. Excuse me? That didn't do anything. That just... Where am I supposed to go? Um... Well, now I'm just confused. Hold on. Let me see if I can... Yeah, I'm gonna run for this battle. Hang on. I wanna run! There we go. Thank you. I don't wanna I don't wanna fight these guys. I wanna try and figure out my way to get out of here. Cause I am very confused about that. Like how how do I leave? Like I legitimately have no idea how I am supposed to leave. Cause that conveyor belt just took us in a circle. And I can't get past this thing. Unless, unless I can move the crane. I guess I can try moving the crane again. I'll try that. I don't want to fight these guys though, so let's just do this. Okay, yeah, we have to move the crane again. All right. Press any two of Y, X, B, and A. All right, come on. Come on. Come on! This is being annoying. I'm... Game? There we go. I want to move the crane. I want to move the barrel, because that's definitely my way out. At least we got some experience, I guess. Although I did waste a little bit of, uh, of time there. No big deal. Yeah, just move the barrel. There we go. That should work. Don't want to fight you guys. And now I can leave. Nice. I was like, how do you leave? That's how. Yay, I can leave now. All right. So now we need to go back up here. Um, give me a second. My worry is that there's a boss fight coming up. Yeah, there's definitely a boss coming up. All right, so I wanna, I wanna, what I wanna do actually is I wanna go back to, really? Uh. All right, let's just use supersonic spin. I wanna refill my, uh, my potions and whatnot because I'm getting a little low. I want to refill my potions. All right. I hope I don't have to do the mini game every time I want to go back though. That would be really stupid. I really hope not. All right, let's go back. All right, so I'll save over here. 
Alright. Now let's head back, or see if we can at least try to head back. Site 32. Oh, you have to race them every time? Alright, well that's a little annoying, but... Alright, well, I mean, this is cool, but I don't want to do this every single time. I just want to get back to the other place so I can restock, and then I'll continue with the plot. Got him. Okay. Whew. That is actually pretty close. I like the music, though. Alright, well, thank God I made it back. Alright. Let's get some more potions, and then we'll continue with the story. Alright. So, yeah. Back down here. And back to the other place. Over here, the uh, Aeris Dome. That way I can refill all my potions, and then we will head off and try and fight that boss. Alright. So over here, it's resting the Enertron. Nice. Yes, I know I'm still as hungry as before. And yes, I have money. Let's try and buy some stuff. So... I want to get, uh, let's get 12, 20 potions. I can, I have enough to spend for that. Now I'm at 30. I should be okay with that. Panacea, fine. Athenian water, let's actually get a couple more. I don't want to spend a thousand. Let's spend, let's get five Athenian waters and that should be okay. Alright, that should be good. I just wanted to refill on potions, honestly, that's all. Now we can go back and head down the left side this time. I hope it didn't reset our progress, though. That would be really stupid. I doubt it did, but still. If it did reset our progress, I'm going to be quite annoyed. All right, well, let's head back. Through Site 32. And... What's this? No. And let's get back to the other side. At least we get to see this awesome music again. Or not see, I guess, here. Oh, I love the music in this minigame. It's so good. Music is so, so good. Alright. Come on. See if I can take him on. I feel like those boosts don't really do anything, honestly. Except, except at the very end, I guess. There we go. Alright, now we're back to the other side, so now we can, uh, go down the left side of the, uh, left side of the lab or whatever. Nice, alright. So now we're back here. Yeah, yeah, I know, Johnny, I know. And let's head off. Across the world map. I'm gonna save here, actually. Sorry we didn't make too much progress today. It was mostly a grinding day, honestly, to get through this. All right, so let's head up here and fight these guys, I guess. I'm just going to use regular attacks against them. I don't want to waste my MP. Alright, let's see what we can do. Yeah, take him out. Doesn't seem worth it to waste any uh, MP on these guys. We can probably easily, easily take him out anyway. Yeah, there we go. Take him out. Some days it's just grinding days with RPGs. That is definitely true. It's definitely a long-term left play for sure. All right, so let's head down to the left side. All right, oh, a save point, that's useful. All right, so in here, more enemies. All right, 
I know. Alright. See what we can do. At least we'll be grinding up some more Mavericks on Friday. That's definitely true. Alright, let's just take these guys out with normal attacks. I don't feel like wasting MP. I know we're not doing a ton of damage, but to be fair, I don't think any attack does a ton of damage against these guys. That did 10 damage, though, which was nice. Uh, we got through half of Mega Man Zero on Friday. Aw, uh, Trash Man. What the heck? Look at that. That hurt. I got attacked by Bubbles. There we go. Alright. Hold on a second. Let's open the chest. We got Shelter. Hatch opened. Huh, nice. Alright, so we can go down here. Uh-oh, some more enemies. Or, I guess, enemy. It's only one of them. Alright. Yeah, that's... That's true, Mr. Bones. Nice. 45 XP. Oh, Jesus. There's a lot of these guys. I mean, again, they're not really worth using ridiculously strong attacks on, so... Yeah, I mean, it's not ridiculously strong. All right, uh, through here. Ooh, another chest is over there. That'll be nice. Let me guess, more enemies dropping out of the... Yep. But, all right, okay, so now we have two orange and one green. What are these guys called? Acids. And those guys are called alkalis. All right, well, let's take out the acids and alkalis. What are these, chemicals? I mean, I know an acid is a type of chemical, but and an alkali is actually a, a descriptor for something. I know an alkali earth... Metal is like uh, part of the periodic table. Is that what they're going for? I don't know. An acid is a combination of elements though, whereas an alkali earth metals are like a type of element on the left side of the periodic table. So, nice. Oh, Chrono's level increase, that's useful. Uh, I have a feeling we don't want to trip that. Or that. Uh, can I grab that? No. Can I grab the A? Hey, there we go. We got Titanium Vest. Let's try equipping that to Chrono. Ooh, that'll definitely come in handy. Alright. So what do these do? Do I have to trip the sensors? Or... We got a Hammer Arm. I bet that's for Robo. Uh, yeah, I bet that's for Robo. Uh... Yeah, there we go. Nice, definitely equipping that. <laughs> oh jeez, I, I am not good at chemistry. Uh, just, just to let you guys know, I am terrible at chemistry. Robo doing some hacking. All systems down, defense lasers deactivated. Nice! Oh, well now there's some enemies though. Guess they waited for the defense lasers to be down. Um, I'm actually gonna use one, uh, gear beam on... Chrono, and then after that, I'll just attack. Yeah, I'll just attack otherwise, because these guys shouldn't be too hard. Science is definitely a, a difficult thing to get through. I would know I'm taking physics right now at the time of this video, but... What the heck was that? Oh, come on, game! What kind of attack was that? That did, like, 30 damage to my whole party. Ugh. All right, get out of here. We just do regular attacks against them. Yeah, regular attacks should work. Come on. Science is definitely something you have to apply yourself to, but once you do, you, you can do some really awesome stuff with it. Especially stuff like physics. Oh, nice. Bobo and Luca both got their levels increased. Excellent. Alright. Uh, what's over here? Is there like a thing I can inspect? No? Alright, well, let's see. Up, down, or cancel? Hmm, interesting. Hold on a second. Uh, I guess we'll go up. I don't really know what to do here. Oh, well there's a save point, that's nice. I'll definitely take that. What happens if we go down? We can still go down. 
we go down further? What is down here? This is weird. Hmm. Okay, so that's that's as low as we can go. I think we're supposed to go down though. Hold on a second. Just want to double check this. I right, see. I think we're supposed to go down here. All right. So what's this? Obtain plasma gun. Nice. Uh, is that for Luca? I want to say it is. Yeah, look at that. That's a that's a much better attack. All right. So what is this? ZB door lock system operational. Please enter passcode. Um, I think it's X A B Y as I wrote it down. So, X. Oh. Nope, I didn't do that right. Hold on. X A B what? Oh great, not this again. This why are there so many passcodes in this part of the game? Seriously. Alright, um. This is getting ridiculous. Okay, well, let's try going a different way for now, because that seems to not really work that well. What's up here? Oh, we're just back up here again. Okay. Well, that didn't really do much. What's, uh, what's to the, what's, what's up then? Hmm. What's in here? A ch oh, we've already been here. I see how this is. Okay, so now we can basically just move freely between floors. I see. So I guess we have to go to the door then. All right, so let's head back down. I understand. I was like, what are we supposed to do? I don't understand this. Never mind. I understand. We have to head all the way down. So now we have to unlock the stupid door. That's annoying. Down. I mean, it said A, B, Y, X, so. All right. Come on, freaking computer. A, B, Y, X. Nice, got it. Finally, whew. All right, let's go through here. What does that do? Uh-oh. Uh, why do I feel like we made a mistake? Emergency, the security system has gone haywire. We must escape immediately. Hold on. Did I mess something up? Was I supposed to get something? Okay, yeah, never mind. We're supposed to do this. Come on. We gotta escape from here. Robo for, Robo for the win. Hurry before it's too late. Whew. Nice going, Robo. All right, we gotta get out of here. All right, so let's get up. Okay, elevators are disabled, so we can't do that. Remember, remember, kids, never take an elevator during a fire. All right, so let's get out of here. What the? Uh-oh. This looks like a boss fight! Wait, these, these are my friends. R64Y, R67Y, R69Y, it is good to see you again. Oh, don't punch him! That's just cruel! What, what are you doing? You are defective. You are not one of us. Pardon? Don't punch him again. I am malfunctioning? Affirmative. 
A defect! I'm a defect! Have you forgotten our assigned task? All intruders must be eliminated. That was the reason for my creation? You disagree our series. Or you dis you disgrace our series. You must be destroyed. Whoa, that is so harsh. Jesus. Oh, get off of him. N no, stop. We gotta fight these guys. Oh, come on. No. Come on, there's gotta be something we can do. Please stop, please. No, get off him. No, let me, do not harm them, please. These robots are my brothers. No, I wanna fight them. These guys are being jerks. No. Man, Robo's already one of my favorite characters. No, Robo! Robo! Now we shall eliminate the intruders. No, I think the intruders will eliminate you! Boss time! All right, it's boss time. Let's take these guys on. I'm a little annoyed at how much damage I'm taking though. All right. Definitely I'm gonna want a potion here. All right. Wait till Boulder fill and then I can use, hold on. All right. Use that. All right, come on. All right, I gotta, I gotta heal Chrono. Jesus, there's so many of them. All right, hopefully I can take these two guys out with that attack. Nice, okay. So yeah, let's definitely heal with Chrono. Uh, potion on Chrono. And can we use Wind Slash on any of them? No. Cyclone, yes. I wanna take out multiple of these guys at the same time. All right. Ow! What the heck was that for? Okay, that's doing a lot of damage. That's really bad. All right, let's do that. And let's heal. Oh, geez. Little, oh, geez. I'm worried about my HP now. Now it's starting to get real bad. At least these two will be gone. I'm gonna take a couple turns to heal because I am really low on health. All right, let's use a let's use a mid potion on Chrono, and you will use a potion on Luca. There we go. All right, and Fire Whirl. Yeah, I gotta kick their butts. No one messes with our friends. All right. Oh, come on. That attack does so much damage. Yeah, I need to heal Luca now. All right. All right, Cyclone. Ow. All right, come on. That does so much damage. All right. Potion. Wind Slash. Nice, okay. Only one. All right. All right, there we go. Okay, nice, got him. 480 XP, 600 gold. Robo! I see him, he got stuck. Luca, what the hell are you doing? Don't, don't stick your hand in the generator. That sounds like a way to die. They really thrashed him. I'm not sure I can fix this. Let's get him back to the protodome for now. Oh, are we gonna teleport there? Okay, that's nice. Thank you, game, I appreciate that. Whew. I like how they're dragging him along the path. <laughs> he probably weighs a lot, to be fair. 
C can you fix me? Don't try to talk. Proto trigger. You are trying to change the world? I don't know how far we'll get, but that's the plan. There'll be a light at the end of the tunnel, oh, I see. Robo, what do you want to do after I finish repairing you? What do I want to do? Yeah, I mean, you were stuck here all this time. There must be a lot of things you want to do, right? No one has ever asked me that before, Luca. Good morning. Robo, thank goodness you're all right. Luca, you're incredible. Well, let's hope I never have to do that again. Luca, I have, I have arrived at an answer to your question. I want to go with you. Really? You mean it? There is nothing left for me here. I want to help you. Together, we might be able to give the life on this planet a chance. Then let's go. The gate's right through here. There's the time gate. Here we go. Time for the warp through time. Back to our own time. Mode seven. Wait, this isn't our own time. Where are we? What the heck? Where are we? This is like a weird isometric viewpoint. There's also a spot where you can swap everyone out as a heads up. Gotcha. What are you? Or who are you? Ah, more drifters. Drifters, where are we? It's not a question of where, my friends, such so much as when. This is the end of time. Travelers lost in time's flow turn up here, much like driftwood on the beach. Might I ask where you're from? We're from 1000 AD. I came from the year 2300 AD. When four or more entities of varying origins en enter a temporal rift together, the, to the, the torsion exerted on time's flow pushes them to the point of least resistance here. There have been a number of folks turning up here un unintended like yourselves. I fear something is having a very powerful, a, a powerful effect on the very fabric of time. Which means it would be safest if one of us stayed here. Here? Alone? It, it is a bleak place, isn't it? But not to worry, for all its desolation, it is well connected. There are roads here to visit any- There are roads here to any time you could ever wish to visit. Should you de so desire, you can call upon your friends at any time, but you can never travel in groups of more than three. One of us must remain. Who will it be, Chrono? Okay, I see. So you can only have three party members at once. Gotcha. Oh, it's echoey? Oh. Um, hold on. All right, hopefully that'll be a little bit better. Uh, okay. So you can only have three party members. Okay. I guess if you're at a save point, you can probably switch or something like that, if I had to guess. Um... I really like having Fire Wave, but I feel like at this point, I actually kind of want to have Robo and Chrono. So let's try Chrono, Ro Robo, and Marl. Don't you go getting any ideas because it's just the two of us, mister. Well, that is the way of things. You can't swap Chrono out, that makes sense. Should you desire to switch party members, you can do so via the main menu whenever you wish. Oh, you don't even have to go to a save point, you can just switch them out. Okay. How do we get back to our own time? You saw the pillars of light when you arrived, yes? Each place, each connects this place to a different era. Once you've been through a gate, you can return. You can use it to return here whenever you wish. Step back into the light and press A once more and you will return to the gate. But beware the gate connected to that bucket. What? This bucket? Guess you can't go over there. HP and MP restored. Oh, that's nice. All right, I definitely want to save here. The end of time. I love this idea. Hey! What's up? You don't need to be in such a rush. Before you go, please have a look past the door behind me. What's over here? What are you looking at? Me? I'm Specchio, the master of war. I watch all kinds of battles from here. How do I look to you? You look pretty... I mean, I feel like if I say weak, it's going to take me on and destroy me. So I'm going to say strong. 
I see. How I look depends on how strong you are. If you're strong, I look strong. If you're weak, I look weak. Hmm? Oh, you've got it in you, don't you? That must be why the old guy let you through. See, a long time ago, before you were born, there was a kingdom where magic flourished. Everyone there could use it. But the people abused their powers and ended up destroying the place. After that, there wasn't anyone left who could use magic. Well, except in friends, of course. But you have it. That inner strength, I mean. Magic needs the power of heart. That's where, the, that's where it flows from. There are four types of magic. Fire, water, light, and shadow. Not everyone's got the same type. You with the punk hairdo, you've got light. The gal with the ponytail is the power of water. What's with the big clunky thing? Sorry, buddy, but well, you aren't alive. I mean, that's true, but ouch. You've got great inner strength for what it's worth. It's just you aren't descended from the ancient magic users, so you're never going to be able to cast spells. Your laser weapons and whatnot should suffice, though. They can inflict shadow damage, kind of like shadow magic. By the way, it's not just magic. Everything is made up of these four elements. All right, starting from the door, circle clockwise along the walls of my room three times and say, I want to use magic over and over in my head. Don't lose track now three times. Don't want you turning yourself into butter. All right, well, I guess I'll do that. There's one. There's two. And here will be three. What? Clockwise along the, along the wall. Isn't this clockwise? There's one. This will be two. And this will be three. There we go. Well done! Ispo Fecto mini, mini Mo Magic O! Nice, I guess I can use magic spells now. Chrono, learn how to use magic. Marl, learn how to use magic. Robo cannot learn magic. So, all fortified with magic. Want to try it out? Sure. All right. All right. Um, I guess I go to tech. Lightning. Oh, that is cool. Ice! Since Robo can't use spells, he has darkness affliction with him being not being a robot. Gotcha. By the way, if I take Luca into here, will she learn magic? Or did I just kind of screw myself out of doing it with Luca? Oh, can't escape? Alright, well I guess I'll just lose all my HP then. Okay, gotcha. I hate how much damage that does. Lightning! Am I gonna die? I'm gonna die. Please don't, like, game over me. Hee hee hee, I win! You make- you make any new friends, you bring them to see me, you hear? I like you guys. Alright, well let's- let's, uh... Let's bring in Luca, then. That girl with the goofy glasses, her power is fire. Ispo facto, facto mini, minimo magico. Okay, there we go. Luca learned to use magic. All right, well, I guess I didn't even need to reload the save, which is nice. Uh, no, I don't want to try it out. Well, nice. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Hey. What do you want? Well, well, it seems I was right. People who lived long ago all enjoyed such powers, you know. Yes, long, long ago. Well, I know you must be eager to finish this thing you, in you seem so intent on doing, but why not first pay a visit back to your own era? Haste makes waste, as they say, and you won't find it that even truer here. Come and see me whenever you have the need. Think of me as your guide on Time's Road. Well, I definitely will. Thank you. All right, uh, I want to swap in Robo for Luca for now. So we store our NP and HP, and let's save. This does look like a place out of Kingdom Hearts. You're absolutely right. I wonder what's over here. Traverse Town? I, I think that's what they're going for. And welcome, Omega X. All right. Protodome? No, I want to go. So where does this go? That's the Protodome. That's Medina Village. Where is where's this then? Oh, 65. Wait, 65 million BC? Uh, let's go here first. Medina Village, yeah. Why can we go to 65 million BC? That's quite a ways away. Well, 
Well, there we go. You folks came out of my wardrobe, didn't you? What are you doing in there? Wait a minute. Medina is a village of friends founded by our ancestors when they lost their war against humankind 400 years ago. Most of the townsfolk still hold a grudge against humans, so be careful. There's an old, there's an odd old human who lives in near a cave in the mountains to the west. He may be able to help you out. Thanks. But why are you being so nice? I thought friends weren't supposed, or I thought fiends weren't supposed to get along with humans. It's been 400 years since man warred against fiend. There's no use living in the past. Of course, many other fiends seem to agree with that. Gotcha. Well, I guess we're back here now. I don't know why this, why the fountain is sparkling at Medina Square. Chrono, what's that creepy chanting? Town of Fiends, be careful. All right. Let me actually save first, just so I don't die. Yep, here we go. Fiendish folk. All right, what the heck is this? You got, you got something to talk about? 400 years have passed since Magus commanded the fiends and waged war against humans. But if Lavos can be reawakened, there will be no more humans. Uh, what? If Lavos can be awakened, there will be no more humans? Oh, great fiend lord. Uh... It was the Fiend Lord Magus who gave life to the almighty Lavos to aid us. And once Lavos awakens from his long slumber, the human race is doomed. Well, that doesn't sound good. That is okay then, that's really bad. The guy with the statue plays a big part later on. Interesting. That's the forest ruins. Hmm. There's an inn over there. Hmm. What's over here? Melchior's cabin. Hmm. Let me see where I'm supposed to go next. Give me a second. I just want to make sure I'm not missing anything. Hold on a second. You only played up until this part. Okay. Yeah, I'm just trying to figure out what I'm supposed to do next. Hang on. I have a guide in case I get lost. Hold on. Well, apparently I want to grab something called the power tab, but honestly, it says that I shouldn't do this, so... Yeah, there are multiple endings, that's fair. Um, alright, so apparently there is something I can grab, but I don't know if it's super necessary. Elder's house. I also might have already made my choice by accident, so... Hold on. How do I get back to the, uh... Residence? Oh yeah, it's probably in here. Yeah, let's go back to uh, 2300 AD. I want to see if I can grab that power tab. Yeah, back to 2300 AD. Hold on. So apparently there's something I can grab now, which is interesting. Hold on a second. One second.
How do you, hmm. Apparently in order to get this power tab thing, um, I need to like, apparently I need to get like a, a speed of over 1500 in the race, which is weird. I'm not quite sure how to do that. Um, let me save. No, I don't want to overwrite my save data yet, actually. Hang on. I want to see what this is, because I'm really confused about that. All right. Let's see. How do I get a score of over 1,500? Like, is that even possible? Hmm. Yeah, the background does look really slick. I agree there. How the hell? Yeah, how the heck do you get that? Hmm, I'm confused. Hang on. I'm confused on how you get that. I heard, yeah, I heard. Uh, thank you for gifting that uh, Hylix to me, by the way, Mr. Bones. I really appreciate it. I'm really confused. Hang on. Hmm. That's we. How do I? Hmm. No, I don't need some pointers. I just I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Like I'm I'm really confused. How do you get the race log? Am I doing this right? Hmm. Um. Hmm. How do you get the race log? Apparently it's found in lab 32, which is over here. I guess I have to walk across the ruins and just try and fight these guys? I don't know. I'm really confused. Sorry, lightning. Yeah, I'm, I'm really confused, guys. I don't really know what to do here. Like, how are you supposed to... How are you supposed to do this? I don't know what that thing is. I'll, I'll be honest. Hold on, I want to take these guys out. I'm going to auto battle for now. Yeah, it's auto battle for this. What are you supposed to do here? I don't, I feel like I'm missing something. Yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, are you referring to Sonic? In that case, I would like to stream Sonic at some point. Uh, we'll, 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 we'll definitely get around to that at some point. I just, uh, I don't have any plans as of right now. I guess we beat them. Nice. Marl's level increased. I got I got a new dual tech. That's nice. How do you get the race log, though? I feel like I'm missing that. Oh, Mighty Number no. 9? Uh, we'll see about streaming that. I don't know. I'm, I'm so confused as to where you find that. Hold on. Trying to find it, hang on. Just 
found. Apparently it's in the chest, but how do I find that? I, I don't know where to go. Hold on. I gotta find out where this stupid race log is because I do not know where it is. It's reached by walking left of the jet bike at the right entrance to the area. What? Reached by walking left of the jet bike at the right entrance to this area. What? I don't see it. Like, I legitimately don't see it. Is it through there? Is that it? Well, now I reloaded those enemies, so let me let me run from this battle. Because I don't want to fight him again. I just want to see where everything is, because I'm really confused. Come on, let me escape. Yeah, let me escape. It must be somewhere over here. Oh, there it is. It's probably in there. All right, let's take these guys out. I'm just gonna auto battle this. All right. Sorry I got so turned around. All right. See what we can do. Just want to take these guys out. Come on. See what we can do. Please die. Alright. I'm just auto battling for now, but I really just want to get past this. I want to see if that's where the race log is. If that's the case, we're good, but. I genuinely don't know where they are. What do you mean, miss? Alright, hang on. Stop auto-battling. Because they, they... Oh, right, I forgot. They don't... They, okay, we gotta use... Uh, we gotta use magic against them. I forgot about that. Or text or whatever. Yeah, there we go. Alright, let's use Cyclone. There we go. That should do a lot of damage. What do you mean that I miss? Are you kidding me? I'm gonna die. Come on, get out of here. Thank you. All right, I'm gonna need to heal after this because that was pretty bad. All right, is this, is this the race log? There we go, race recorder. That's what I was looking for. All right, so now we can head back. Jeez, I was like, where the hell do you find that thing? Okay. At least we found it. So I'm going to actually save on the world. I'm going to head back to the end of time real quick and restore my HP and MP, and then we'll go and uh, try and deal with that. Ah, oh, that was annoying. All right, so let's head back to the uh, Protodome, go back to the end of time, and restore HP and MP. Then we'll try and race a little bit. All right. All right, let's see what we can do. End of time. Come on, let me restore my HP. There we go. And back to 2300 AD. Yep. I love that mode seven, it's so cool. All right, we'll try a couple of times on the race, and if we don't get it, we'll just do it again later, honestly. After that, we should probably try and continue the plot. All right, so down here. All right, through here. Let's see what we can do. So much mode seven, pretty cool. Yeah, I agree. All right, so now what do we do? Hey, looks like you got your hands on something spiffy. That baby can record your highest scores. Ask RXXR for the lowdown. I'm guessing that's RXXR. Greetings, racing life forms. I am RXXR, the record keeper. I'll record your three highest scores. There are two ways you can race, Johnny. Which would you prefer? 
Uh, turbo boost available or no turbo boost? Uh, hmm. Hold on a second. I'm just trying to figure out what the correct way to get through this is. Alright, uh, let's go with Turbo Boost. I'll let you use the jet bike, because that's the kind of guy I am. Don't sweat and don't you dare chicken out, babe. Alright, so I guess we should use the, the uh, jet bike then. Alright, let's see what we can do. I need to get 1,500 for this, apparently. I don't know how that works, though. Alright, come on. How the hell do I get that much... Oh, that's cool. I can kind of rotate the map a little bit. Kind of smooth, yep. Well, I won, but I only got 700 points. Hmm. How do I get 1,500? That's like over halfway off. It must be doing something I'm doing wrong. You beat me? Okay, yada, yada, yada. Impressive, that's a new high score. You got some skills, don't you? 746. What do you have to say? Do you want to change the race mode? Yeah, let's try, uh... Let's try no turbo boost this time. All right, let's try this again. Oh, this is cool. Ah, oh, geez. Really hard to do this. All right, come on. Come on, get ahead of him. I'm gonna lose. Well, I got 649 that time. That wasn't great. I have no idea how you're supposed to get 1500. That's That seems like it's impossible. I mean, apparently it's not required to beat the game, but still. I think I'm gonna dip out of that for now. I'll just, I'll do that again later at another point. I have no idea how you're supposed to even get close to that. 649, yeah. We'll, we'll dip out for now on that one. Let's head back to the uh, Millennial Fair. I think knocking with Johnny takes off 10 points. Oh, that makes sense. But I don't think that would be enough in order to get... I'm gonna look up how that works. I'm very confused. We'll do that again later. For now, let's head back to our own time. All right, time for some more Mode 7! All right, and through here... Medina Village, 1000 AD, yes. All right, let's see. Through this portal... What are we supposed to do here? Because I'm really confused. Alright, so let's... No, I don't want to do that. I want to save. Yep, there we go. Nope. Alright, there we go. What is this? Forest Ruins. Well, there's a chest up there, at the very least. A mid ether. Nice! Hold on. Um... Trying to figure out where to go.
Sorry, I'm just trying to figure out where to go. Hold on. Okay, so apparently I have to go to the Elder's house, so let's head over there. So, Alright, Elder's house. Let's talk to the Elder. I'm Ozzy the Eighth, the leader of this village. My great, 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 great grandfather fought against the humans at the side of the Fiend Lord himself. Oh, great Fiend Lord, why didn't you exterminate the human race four centuries ago when you had the chance? That's a little weird. Hold on. Oh, well, apparently, if, if we if we examine some stuff, we can actually grab some stuff over here, so, hold on. Yeah, I know. Hold on. I think it's that thing over there. Can't get over there, though, because the stupid NPC is in the way. Hold on. What is this? Yeah, I know. Hold on, let me move let me move out of the way so we can go all the way to the right. Oh nice, I got a speed capsule. Well that's useful. Apparently there's uh oh a magic capsule too. Excellent. So I guess that increases my magic and speed by one. Alright. So I guess we can use those. Alright, where are they? No. I guess we go to equipment then. No, how do I how do I use cleave? Oh, well I still need a, a 152, but I guess I'll be getting that soon. How do I use um Okay, here we go. Speed capsule. Um let's increase robo speed a little bit. And I'll also use uh and I'll also increase uh Robo's magic. All right. Nice. So I guess we go up to the forest ruins then? Question mark? Hold on. Apparently I need to head to the Hecran Cave, and I have no idea where that is. Although let's actually visit the marketplace. I'm, I'm, let's, see what, let's see what the prices are like. I got nothing to sell to humans. Get out of here. Plead. Humans think they've got a right to everything. Teach them a lesson, boss. Wait, what? I have to fight you? What the heck is that? I will definitely posture check, but... Now I have to fight these guys. What the heck is this? That's doing nothing. I'm literally not... Okay, I, have to, I can't use magic attacks. Gotcha. Okay, I don't know why I have to fight him. I have to fight the shopkeeper. They they beat your boss? Monsters! Can I have something? Alright, I'll sell. Thank you. What? 65,000? What the? What kind of price is that? 2,080 for a potion? What? I don't even want your stuff. This is like, this is absurd. Look at this! 65,000 for a high potion! I don't even have 11,000! Oh man, that is such a ripoff! Zan Mato. Okay, I don't even want your stuff. Hey, you think I'm gonna charge a human going the, the going rate? <laughs> Mr. Bones, to quote Dante, what the hell is this? Exactly! That is such a ripoff! I don't even want your stuff now! That is blah! All right, can I at least rest at the inn? No room here for humans. Scat! Please. You still talking to me? Don't know what's what's good for you, do ya? Get him, boys! All right, I guess we're fighting more enemies. I just want to rest at the inn, please. If they charge me 65,000 again, I'm going to lose it. Alright. They better not charge me 65,000. Alright, at least I got some stuff. Ah, help! 20. 200 gold? That is also a ripoff! No! 
Everything in this city is a ripoff. Jeez. All right. Well, in that case, let's just head back to the end of time. Because that seems like the best way to, uh, to heal up. That is, that is ridiculous, dude. Come on. You're right, Mr. Bones. What the hell is this? How dare you charge me 65,000? 65,000 for, for like freaking high potions. That is ridiculous. All right. That is stupid. All right, yeah, Medina Village. Man, what, 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 ah. Uh, this is, ah. Uh, I don't know what to say about that. All right, now I'll save. All right, so we need to head to a cave of sorts now, apparently. So I guess it's down here. Is this it? Hecarim Cave, yes. Death to the enemies of fiend kind. Okay, guess we're just fighting these guys now. All right, let's just actually, let's do this on auto battle for now. One of the other portals leads to somewhere really cool. I did hear that like apparently one, you can warp straight to the final boss or something like that, which is insane. I, I, I'm guessing it's that bucket portal he was talking about. Although I don't know how to access that. All right, what the hell is down here? Oh, there's a chest. Obtain ether. Well, that's nice. More enemies? Oh, that thing is not a pot. I thought that was like going to be an item that I could attack or something. Alright, uh, let's use Aura Whirl. Oh no, I want to use Supersonic Spin on everyone. There we go, Supersonic Spin! Depending on where, when you go fight Lavos with certain members, it will give you different endings. Yeah, that's what I heard. That's a really cool idea that it gives you like multiple endings depending on when you fight uh, the bad guy, which I'm, I guess is Lavos in this case. All right, so I guess we're going down here. More enemies. Who are these guys? All right. Uh, let's just do a Cyclone and I'll just attack these guys. Five, what do you mean five? I'm doing like nothing against these guys. What the heck? Uh, I guess I can try fire. Oh, I can't do fire on this one, but. All right, wind slash. Look at these wind slash did a lot. All right, let's attack. I'll do wind slash again. That seems to be a decent amount. I'm gonna switch Marl out for uh, Luca actually for now. Well, at least Chrono's level increased. All right, let's switch out Marl for Luca. Although Luca's at level 13, so actually, if anything, I should switch out. No, nah, actually, I'm all right for this. Robo's gonna be one of the tankiest members in the game. I figured as much. Something down there. Oh, there's a chest over there. Can I grab the chest? Okay, there we go. Mid ether. Well, that's nice. What's up here? More enemies. Oh, more of these guys. All right. All right. So Wind Slash seems to do a lot of damage. Uh, or a Beam. I don't know what that does, but I have a feeling I don't want to use it yet. All right. He's a tech. What is laser? How much is Laser Spin going to do? A decent amount. Laser, laser Spin is a decent amount. All right. I'll just, I'll just attack these guys for now. All right, I forgot. Um, I have not played Kingdom Hearts, sadly, no. Hopefully in the future I will be able to do so. Oh, nice, Robo's level increased, all right. Uh, let's see. There's another chest up here. What's in here? Ether, nice. Getting a lot of items here. Let's see what's down here. More enemies. Nice. What are these guys? All right. Uh, let's try using Cyclone on these two. All right. Nice. That didn't do a whole lot, but that's okay. Uh, 
No, I'll just use laser spin. That's true, but I don't have the Epic Games Store, um, just for personal reasons. Um, if they ever come to Steam, I probably will pick them up, but... Also, they're, like, full price, and I am not, I'm not paying full price for that. Because I know for a fact they go on sale pretty frequently. Got these bat guys. Alright, uh, let's see. One. Uh... Let's try using a lure against the bat, just for the hell of it. They'll never come to Steam? Well, that's on. Once it's on Epic, it stays on Epic. That's not always true, but I see what you're saying. Um. Wind Slash. Yeah, I know the feeling. What is. Oh, please don't hypnotize me. God damn it! Alright. Let's use Ice! Maybe it'll take the bat out. Nice. Alright. See what we can do. Try attacking them normally. That does like 8 damage, come on. Alright, I need to switch to Luka, because I really need that flame attack. Otherwise, I'm going to die. All right, wind slash. Nice. And let's do another wind slash. Damn it, please don't. Okay, thank God. All right, please die. Nice. All right. 120 gold. All right. Not bad, not bad. Uh, anything over here? No. All right, so I guess we should just continue along. More and I, I assume that's an enemy. Yep, take it as much. All right, got more of these octopus guys. Uh, let's try lightning. And I'll just use, uh, I'll just attack normally, I guess. Nice, that guy's out. These guys seem to be very susceptible to magic attacks, it seems. Although not so much to physical attacks. Supersonic spin! Why not, Mr. Bones? That did a lot. Get out of here. Although I can't see now. Alright. Let's see. Oh, what's this? A mysterious force seals it shut. Did I really go all this way just to find nothing? Oh, okay, I can go in here. I can go down here, I guess. Um, alright, and I guess up here. Oh, nice, a save point. Although I didn't get that chest sad. Oh, no, I already got that chest. Okay. So here's a save point. Why do I feel like there's a boss fight coming up? It, it, it feels like there is one. Hold on. My health isn't... Well, Chrono's health isn't great. Um, let's try going in like this and see what happens, but I guarantee you it's a boss. Death to the enemies of fiend kind! Boss fight! I knew it! Alright, let's take you on. First things first. Uh... No, let's use... Cyclone. Ow! Um, I'm gonna use Aura on Chrono. Let's use, uh, Rocket Punch. Nine! That did, like, nothing! Come on! Alright, uh, let's try using Wind Slash. Uh-oh, I don't like the look of that. Ooh, that did a lot of damage. Alright, Wind Slash seems to do a lot. Uh, let's use, let's use, uh, Aura on myself. And let's try Laser Spin this time. Why do I hear boss music? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, okay, that did significantly more. Water 2? Uh-oh. Yikes! Oh god! Okay, that's really bad. Let's use Wind Slash. Let's use, um, Aura, Aura Beam. Oh, jeez. Chrono's almost dead. I need to heal. That's good. I actually might need to do that attack again. Alright, let's try that again. And I will use Laser Spin. Alright, there we go. 
Really need to think quickly about this. 95. Oh, Water 2 does so much damage. Alright. So now let's use Lightning. Um, Ice. And I'm actually going to use an Ether, or a Mid Ether on uh, myself. Alright, I definitely need to use Aura Beam again. There we go. Oh, jeez. Chrono, don't die. Okay. Alright, I can probably get away with... Alright, let's use Aura Whirl. That way I can restore some health. There we go. And... Uh, laser Spin. Gotta, gotta really concentrate here. 94... Oh, water too! It does so much damage. Alright, um, mid ether on myself. Let's use um a potion on on uh well we don't need to use it on everyone, but let's especially use it on uh Robo. Alright, uh yeah, aura beam. We're gonna need to use this. And I will use lightning. There we go. Come on. Oh, water two. I hate that attack so much. It does like half of my health. All right. All right. All right. Come on. There we go. Thankfully that seems to do a lot of damage. All right, come on. You gotta be close to death. Can you please stop using Water 2, though? I'd really appreciate it. Married Cyclone? What is that? Okay, that did a decent amount. All right, let's try using uh, Supersonic Spin this time. And I'll use Aura on... Um, I'll use Aura on Chrono. Here we go. Married Cyclone isn't as bad. Yeah, this is pretty intense. He's taking a lot of hits. Oh, don't do it twice. Come on. Alright. Uh, oh, Chrono might be dead. Yeah, Chrono's dead. Hold on. Um. Okay, where's my Panacea? Oh, no, my um, Athenian Water. And then Aura on Chrono. Alright, and then, or again on Chrono, and then let's use Supersonic Spin. Come on, he's gotta be almost dead. He's taking so many hits. No, not one or two! Crap, crap, that's bad. Alright, uh, Aura Beam. Lightning. Please be almost dead. Come on, this is getting ridiculous. Jesus Christ, this guy will not die. Oh my god. Try using cy regular Cyclone. How much does that do? 10? That was a waste. Alright. Yeah, we need to use Aura Beam because that's going to do a lot. Okay. All right, come on. You gotta be almost there, please. All right, uh, Wind Slash. Okay, I see. So whenever he says that, he does Water 2. Gotcha. Okay, I understand. All right. I gotcha. So I don't want to attack when he's doing that. I, un I understand. Alright, let's use ice and laser spin. Please, uh, please die. So I don't want to attack when he's doing that, that, this thing, because that's when he does that. Laser spin. 98. Please die, for the love of God. 
Oh my lord. Alright. Uh, supersonic spin. Alright. And let's use let's use ice on him. Actually, I should really heal. Crap, I just realized. Marl has like no Oh I win! Let's go! We win! Marl's level increased. Get out of here! If only Lord Magus destroyed the human race 400 years ago when he first brought forth Lavos, the world would belong to us fiends now. Krarg! Get out of here. Whew, that was a bit of a tough boss. I will definitely hydrate after that. In the Middle Ages, Magus created Lavos, who destroys the world in the future. Oh, jeez. That was actually a tough boss. I didn't understand that his counterattack was water too. I should have I should have figured that out, especially as someone who is very attuned to the element of water considering my hydration uh joke, I guess. Or hydration running joke. And then posture check. Thank you very much. Alright. Yes. If we were to defeat Magus in the Middle Ages, might it be possible for us to change history? Hey, Chrono, what if we use the gate at the fairgrounds? Interesting. That's an interesting idea, actually. Let's go over here, though. Jump in? Sure. I assume this will take us back to the world map. I figured as much. Yay, we're back! There's Luca's house. Yay, we're back to our own time. Let's go! All right, let's definitely rest up, because that was intense. All right, whew. Uh, how do I rest? Hold on. Uh, yeah, 10 gold is fine. 200 gold is not. <laughs> I'm surprised Robo immediately didn't rust from getting into water. Yeah, good point. All right. All right, down here. See what we can do. Alright. So I guess we should go back to the, uh... Yeah, I guess we should go back to the... Actually, wait, let's see if we can upgrade our equipment. I'm curious if they have anything new at the, uh, marketplace. Please don't be ridiculously overpriced. That would suck. Yeah, market. Alright. Let's see what we got. Um... Eh, the iron bow gun might be helpful. Let's see. All right, yeah, let's get the iron bow gun for, uh, for, uh, Mars there. And, um, how many potions? 25, that's fine. Panacea, 10. Athenian water, let's get another one. Shelter, 7. All right, we're good to go. Oh, let's equip, uh, Marl. Oh. Let's see, we want to equip the bandit's bow. Alright, nice. Thank you very much. And let's save. Go. Um, remember, we didn't... Frog kind of ran off in the past. We don't know where he is right now. Alright, so I guess we should go to the portal. Alright, so I guess we have to defeat we have to defeat Magus in the past. Oh, we're back here again. What do you have to say, old man? Oh. Well I guess this'll just be a new uh No, we don't wanna go to Lean Square. We wanna go to um Truce Canyon, I believe, is what is where we have to go. Frog is that one guy who um Hold on. Frog is the one guy who, uh, who helped us defeat that evil priest at the beginning of the game. Um, oh. Actually, you know what? Apparently there's stuff we can do in the, in the, um, in 1000 AD that's really helpful, so let's do that first. Alright. So wait, where is the bucket exactly? Is that this? Is, is this the bucket? 
That date leads to 1999 AD, the day of Lavos. If you wish to see the world destroyed before your very eyes, then by all means go. But know that you you yourselves might share the same fate. Okay, so that bucket is where is where you go to Lavos. Okay, so that's that's the final boss of the game, I presume. So th this is very similar. This kind of reminds me of Ukulele and the Impossible Layer in that I know this game came way before that. But um that's interesting that I guess you can fight the final boss really at any time. So, 1999, that's when the game got released. Oh, that's clever. All right, so let's actually grab some stuff from Luca's house because apparently that'll be very useful. Also, I want to rearrange my party. I want to put in uh, Luca instead of Mario for now. All right. I like Robo though, he's pretty cool. All right, so let's go over to Luca's house real quick and then we'll continue with the story. All right, come on, Luca's house. All right. So yeah, where do we, so where do we go to get this stuff? Let's see. Mm -hmm. Up here, maybe. Luca and Tabin are always off tinkering on their on their latest inventions. I brought you this apple with what we learned today. Oh, you're so thoughtful. Hold on. We need to we need to talk to Tabin, I guess. Hold on. Where's the dad? I, I literally just saw him. There we go. Oh, perfect timing. Obtain Tabin's vest. Yeah, this is what I wanted to get. Another great invention just completed. The ultimate in defense for my beautiful daughter. See, so yeah, I wanted to grab that real quick because I, I just read it on the guide. Uh, let's go to equipment. Uh, yeah, I want to use the Tabin's vest. Ooh, yeah, that is a pretty big uh, defense buff. Nice. All right, and um, hmm. Apparently, there's something else in uh, in the market. I forget if we saved one of the guys in the prison, but apparently, if we did, we can get like ten mid ethers, which would be nice. But I don't remember if we did or not. So, I don't know where to go for that. So, I guess for now... Hmm. I would like those 10 mid ethers, but I don't know where, uh... What's his name? Hmm. Hold on a second. Alright. You saw... All I saw at the prison was the dino tank? Yeah. Hold on, where's the, uh... I don't know where Fritz and Elaine are, but apparently they're the people I can get 10 mid ethers from if I save them. I guess if we if we can, we'll come back to that later, but for now, let's just continue with the story. All right. Yeah, we'll, 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 we'll come back to that later. All right, so... On to Truce Canyon. Sorry about that. It's more like X5. Oh, okay. All right, so now we're on to the next chapter of the game. Give me a second. All right, so I guess we need to head out. Or head off of, uh, head out of this place. So let's go through here. What the? I don't really feel like fighting these guys. He probably won't give us much it. Well, I guess we can fight him since we'll destroy them. I mean, look at that, 198. Probably not gonna get much experience from this though. All right, so yeah, we're gonna get like no experience from this. Well, oh, we got a new dual tech though, so that's nice. So let's go down here. More of those enemies. All right, so where do we go? Hold on. All right, so we need to go to Guardia Castle then. So through the forest. Might have to fight an enemy or two. 
Oh, or not. And to the castle. All right. Halt, who goes there? Oh, it's you again. Yeah. Who we got? Lord Chrono, the great hero has appeared from the very pages of legend. He arrived not too long ago, then left to meet the king. His majesty is recuperating in bed. Queen Lean has been at his majesty's bedside night and day. All right, well, I guess we need to head up to, uh, to the chambers. So up here, up here, and up here. Let's see what's over here. Through here. Oh, these, these aren't the right bed chambers. I guess the other side of the castle? I guess we go to the other side of the castle then? Huh. A little confused. All right, let's see what we can do. Hmm. All right, where do we go? Because apparently we need to head to the uh, king's bedside. At least I think so. At least I think this is where we're supposed to go, right? Maybe over here? Yeah, here we go. Queen Lean will collapse if she does not get some rest. Sir, Sir Cyrus must have sent that boy to us. Oh, Chrono, have I grown too old for all this? With Sir Cyrus so nowhere to be found, all our hope rests on, this, on the shoulder of that boy who bears the hero's badge. He has gone to the southern continent now to search for the sword that can slay Magus. All right, well, that's helpful. I guess that's all we have to do here. Hold on. One second. Let's try to figure this out. Oh, okay, I need to head to the kitchen. So where's the kitchen, then? Let's see where we have to go. Can I go down here? No. Where is the kitchen? I do not understand. Uh, is it over here? Hold on. What do you say? Uh, I want to say it was... I don't think it's over there. I have a feeling it's over here. Okay, the master of kitchens has his hands full. Trying to get food to the front lines while making sure the king keeps up his strength. So I think we have to go down here. Come on now, time is wasting. Is it food, is this food fit for the king? We must help the king maintain his stamina. We must hurry for the provision for the Xanon Bridge as well. We're in the kitchen, but nothing's happening. Hmm. Might be in the wrong place, hang on. Um, I feel like I'm doing something wrong here. Like, please don't tell me. And the game crashed. Dang it. I figured that was going to happen. All right. Um, let me, let me see how far back we got sent. And if we got too, sent too far back, I'm probably just going to end the stream here. All right. Because the game just crashed. Whoops. All right. Okay, we didn't get sent back far at all, thank God. I just don't understand what we're supposed to do here. I mean, we talked to the people, but... Game said it was time to stop. Ah, I see what you did there. Come on now, your king is wounded too. He's not, uh, he, isn't, he hasn't given up. Big pardons, my lord. Beds are all taken. Ouch! The Fiend Lord has brought three fearsome generals onto the field of battle. The food supplies are being rationed on the front lines. There will soon be none left. Ooh, that's not good. All right, well, I'm talking to pretty much everyone, and I don't really know what to do. Maybe these two know what to do? His Majesty is recuperating in bed. Queen Lead has been in His Majesty's bedside night and day. So then what am I supposed to do? Hang on. I don't understand. Hold on. 
Because I'm in Guardia Castle. Okay, apparently I might need to go to the bridge. Hold on. Alright, so apparently I need to go to Zenon Bridge first, so that's why he's not showing up. Alright, so let's head to Zenon Bridge, and then we'll probably end off the stream over there. Because apparently that's where we have to go, I guess, in order to trigger that dialogue. That's weird. Alright. Alright, so Zenon Bridge is over here, I believe. Uh, let's save. There go. The hero appears. Zen and Bridge. All right. Oh wait, no. Nope. I want to. I want to go into Zen and Bridge. Our prov Our provisions are depleted. Have the supplies still not arrived from the castle? We'll starve at this rate. We sent our finest knights to march on to the enemy in order to assure the hero's safe passage. I thought those stories of the hero would would come bearing the badge. I bet. I thought those stories of the hero who would come bearing the badge no more than bedtime tales, but now he's come and there's little to do but trust in him. Could the hero alone truly have the power to defeat an army of fiends? Maybe. What would our system... Would our strength were... What would that our strength were enough to best the fiend lord's army, but alas, our only hope lies with the hero. I don't think we can go... Okay, we can't progress from here. We're, we've no more foodstuffs. All right, so now I guess we head back to the uh, the uh, castle now. Let's see. Let's see if that'll trigger the uh, next part of the game. Because I am very confused as to where we're supposed to go. Hope we didn't soft lock ourselves or anything. That would be really bad. All right, up to the castle. Or actually, down in the kitchen, which is over here. Alright, let's see what we can do. Okay, here's the chef. Master of kit. What? My brother's larders are nearly empty? Hmm, serves him right, thinking with- thinking you men with swords are the only ones protecting the kingdom. Enough of that! Are you never going to set aside your petty feud? You're grown men, act like it! Mind your own business. What do you know of it anyway? Mm -hmm. Well, that's a little bit rude. Come on, dude. Come on now, time is wasting. Can I take this stuff? Oh, what's what's this? Obtain ether. Well, that's nice. All right, now what do I do? Because I, I the dialogue played out. Um. Okay, now I leave the kitchen. I head back to the entrance. Wait! Huh, huh. Take this for the troops. Obtain spiced jerky. I don't know what's so spiced about it, but all right. And this is for you, here. Strength capsule, well that's useful. Thank you, I appreciate that. When you see that fool brother of mine, tell me that better come back alive. Alright, well, I'll definitely use the strength capsule. Alright, uh, let's see. Strength capsule, and I'll use it on... Uh, I'll use it on Chrono for now. Alright, now what do we do? Alright, um... Let's see. Hold on a second. All right, so now we go back to the, uh... All right, now we go back to the, uh, what's it? The bridge over there, so let's head over there. We're probably gonna end off the stream pretty soon, actually, because we're almost at three hours. So... All right, let's head back to over here. Back to the bridge, I'll save. Yep, save. All right, and Zenon Bridge. Lord Chrono, what word? Give him the food? Yes. Food! He brought us food! It was my brother? I see. He saved us all. I don't know how he saved you guys, but alright. 
Lord Chrono, if I should not return alive, give my brother my thanks. Uh-oh. What's happened? Uh-oh. Magus' troops have launched their attack. Our defenses will not hold. You are Knights of Guardia. Defend the honor of our order and drive the enemy back whence it came. But we are far outnumbered. This is our last line of defense. It must not break. Well, very well, my lord. All right, looks like we're gonna have to help him out. As you can see, Lord Chrono, it's all my men can do to hold this line. Might you lend your, your blade to our battle as well? Sure thing. You have my most profound gratitude. The Fiend Lord's troops are positioned just beyond the bridge. Take this with you, mate, keep you safe. Oh nice, I got a golden helm. All right. I wanted to equip it, but whatever. Let's take out these enemies. Yep, let's kick some butt before we end it off. I'm Ozzy, one of Lord Magus's three generals, and to his enemies I grant death. Go, my children, take them to their graves. Let's do this. All right, let's do a combo fire whirl. Take him out. Zero? How did that do zero? All right, let's try this. Okay, I get... Wait, that healed them? How did that heal them? Oh, great. Well, this is not good. Oh, because dark on dark, I see. Okay, well, we're definitely switching party members after this, because I understand. Four damage, wow. Now, I want to attack you, and I will use Flamethrower. That did a lot of damage. All right, let's try using, yeah, let's just, let's just attack. All right, there we go. Nice. All right. So how do I attack this guy? Because it doesn't seem like I'm doing a, oh geez, that, that is doing a lot of damage. 101, nice. Ah, he's in a pickle. I got thunder for the last dude. Good point. Well, like I killed him, but hmm, stronger than I thought. All right, let's switch party members real quick. Um, I want uh, Robo out and Marl in. So, party. No, I want Marl for Robo. Actually, no, let's have Luca for Marl, because Luke. Let's do this. All right, so let's keep going. Wait up already. It seems I misjudged you the first time, but I won't do it twice. All right, more of these skeleton guys. Slay them all. All right, let's use Cyclone. All right, Let's see what we can do. Once I fi de finish the bridge, we're definitely gonna end things off. All right, uh, combo ice. So using ice against this guy. Okay, that, that, that sells it. I definitely have to kill the skeletons first. Or, at the very least, do this. Wind Slash. Ow. Eh, that's, okay, Wind Slash is definitely pretty useful. Yep, there's a lot of spooky, scary skeletons for sure. Alright, see what we can do. Uh, no, I don't want to use that. I, although, that being said, Rocket Punch seems to do a lot. And I can use Wind Slash. Yeah, Rocket Punch does a lot. Ozzy's spell is broken. Nice. Drat! Alright, uh, let's heal a little bit. Uh, inventory. Let's use a potion. On, uh... I guess everyone. Although, I really want to switch out to, uh... Right, let's switch Luca back in instead of Robo. And let's use another potion. On Luca. There we go. All right, now we're good to go. Okay, this must be the end of the line. Th that's it, this time you're finished, I mean it. Isn't it about time you gave up? Mess with Chrono and you'll be sorry. All right, more skeletons. Uh-oh. Big boy. 
boss time! Go, Zomboar! Crush Lord Magus' enemies! Alright, now we got a full-on boss fight. Alright, let's use lightning against him. That did a lot. The Grah! Please don't do a ton. Ah, uh, 40's a lot. Alright, uh, ice. And... Let's try fire whirl. Okay, yeah, ice doesn't work. Noted. Let's try fire whirl. Wait, why am I healing? Is that, Am I healing the guy? It's hard to tell. Alright. At least I'm doing some decent damage. Alright. Alright, uh... Let's see. Light, lightning doesn't work, but Wind Slash does, and so does Cyclone. Alright, uh... Let's just attack. And then... Let's do that. Come on. Grah! Alright. Alright, let's use a potion on... Jesus Christ, that's bad! Alright. Alright, uh... Flamethrower, I guess? Oh no, Flamethrower's probably gonna heal him. I just realized. Okay, that doesn't heal him, thankfully. Alright, let's do Aura Whirl. So that way I can heal everyone. And I will again use Flamethrower. Nice. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Grah! Alright, let's see. Uh, let's see. Fire Whirl. Fire Whirl seems to do a lot of damage, thankfully. No, that heals his top half, though. Death, death, death. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Okay, is, is that's dead, thankfully. So let's... No, let's use Aura. Oh, jeez. Chrono's dead. At least I healed myself. Alright. Uh, I need to use a... Athenian Water. And then I need to use Aura on Chrono. Alright, so don't use Fire on the top half, noted. Alright, uh, let's see if I can use Lightning on the top half. No, lightning heals him. Crap. Okay. Waters are your phoenix down. That's true. Let's just use regular attacks then. Can I use wind slash? No. Oh, okay. I can't use I can't use magic attacks. I have to use physical attacks. Gotcha. Okay. Well, that did a lot of damage. I need to heal though. Oh, geez. Please don't kill Luca. Please don't kill Luca. Okay, yeah, I need to heal. Alright. This is this is this is bad. This is really, really bad. Alright, I need to use physical attacks against him, because otherwise I'm not gonna do anything. Because all my magic attacks seem to be healing him. So physical attacks it is. Ah, but he keeps doing that is the problem. Alright, item, potion. Alright, there we go. Alright, potion. Uh, mid potion on. I didn't need to do that. Crap. Well, I guess I'll I'll heal all the way. Ah, this is brutal. Lower equals magic and top equals physical. Yeah, I know. I'm just trying to. Alright, there we go. I need to attack with physical attacks here, or else I'm not gonna kill this guy. Well, that did a lot of damage, thankfully. Steals MP? What the hell? Well, he's dead, so that's nice. Whew. Well, Chrono's level increased, and I learned Antipode Bomb. Thank God. Whew. Actually, we should probably go... Alright, well, now we can go back into the Xenon Bridge. Talk to these guys. Thanks to your aid, we were, able, we were able to defend the bridge, but unless we defeat Magnus, Magus, it's in, it's in, what is it? It's a empty victory, all right. 1,500 gold, that's definitely well off. 
Ah, uh, whew. That was an exhilarating ending. I was really concerned about death there. What do you guys have to say? We could not have regained this bridge without you. Okay, I guess they all say the same thing. Yeah, okay. Well, we I appreciate that. Thank you, ever. Thank you, soldiers. Yep, we saved the bridge. And let's just see where we're going next. Alright. Hold on. Alright, so apparently we need to go south to Hore. Hold on. Yona's Villa. Is this Pore? Hard to tell. Dorino Inn, Residence. Hold on. Okay, yeah, we're definitely in the right place. Because this is Fiona's Villa. So, let's see what's in here, at least. My husband, Marco, hasn't returned from the war, but we plan and... But we planted and intended these woods together, so I mean to do my best to protect them until the day he returns. Noted. Alright, well, that is going to end off this stream of Chrono Trigger. I do hope you guys enjoyed. Um, actually, let's rest at the inn real quick, because I know there is one. Yeah, Dorino Inn. And that's where we'll end off the stream. So, 50 gold's a bit much, but I'll take it. I mean, we, we just gained 1,500, so that's actually not a bad deal. Can we get anything from the drawers by any chance? Or no. Nothing from that drawer. And nothing from that drawer. Fair enough. Alright, well, let's save and then we will quit. So. Whew! That was exhilarating. We actually accomplished quite a bit in, that, in this episode. We found Robo, we got back to our own time, we found out about the end of time, we took on a couple of boss fights, actually. And we had some fun along that that Mode 7 speedway, that was really cool. But, uh, next time we will explore a little bit more of 600 AD, and see what else the story brings. Thank you all so, so much for watching, and I hope you all enjoyed this episode of Chrono Trigger. This is 112, signing out for now. See you all later. Have a good night, everyone.